Mr. Geddes? Hey, Sir? Uh, we had another incident with the uh, Laramie boys. Yeah, there was an incident. Well, I mean to scare me. Are you scared? A little. I've got a lot invested in this place, and, and not just the land, but, but my family. It's, uh, it's hard to explain. I understand. I'll do my best to keep you safe, sir. Uh, I know you will. So how's your family? Uh, just fine. I should probably head back. <laughs> Yeah, I know how it is. <laughs> How'd you get on? Okay, I guess. Better? Sure, I'm just tired. I know. That's some good food. Anybody want some more? Uh, no, no, I'm thank good. You. I miss Mr. Pearson. <laughs> You're such a pig. <laughs> <laughs> All right, it's getting late. Let's get some rest. Pearson night, was a good cook. Good night, Mama. Good night, Jack. Good night, Pa. Bro, I'm gonna be honest. I don't know how they slept in those things, dude. I gotta sleep at least in my boxers. What the hell was that? What are you? What are you doing? Otherwise, I'm sleeping butt ass naked too. Either my box or butt ass naked. One of those two. Don't open it unless you know it's me. The sundials on fire! What do you want, pussy? You don't think I can handle myself, boy? I heard about you. I hate you. Dub Hicks, prop this on yourselves. Keep them coming. Oh, God. Jim, you know that offer? Ow. You dumb bitch. 2v1? Can I get a gun, please? Come here, you dumb bitch. Come here, fatty. He ain't getting up. They've killed Mr. Tolbert, and they've stolen my goddamn cattle. You men okay? I think so. Yeah. Jim Milton saved my life. It's Mr. Abel. Yeah, of course, it's Mr. Abel. I can't believe he thinks it can scare me out of here. Then I guess we're getting your cattle back, uh, I sir. guess we are. Can you go too, Tom? Of course, sir. All right, Jim. I know you can handle yourself. A little. Go get your guns and head out. Guns? Oh, don't play coy with me, son. We need your help. I don't care what you used to do or what your, your, your name is. This is the land of second chances. Understood. Okay. Oh, here we go. Here we go! We got some shit! Mr. Getty's cattle was taken. I'm sorry to hear that. What are you doing in It's that time place? to ride again. Real good to us. We... I... What are you doing? My job, Abigail. My goddamn job. Let's go! Off your horses here. We'll be better on foot. Okay. If you say so. And that's the place up ahead. There's our cows. A couple guards out front. A couple more around the side, I imagine. Let's get a closer look. Let's go. Yeah. There's plenty of guards. I'm gonna head straight in. Yep, Tom. You head up there and try and give us some cover. Abe, you're gonna try and flank the place and come in from the back. I'll give you a minute or two, then I'm heading in. Yes, sir. Okay. Oh, shit. Hey! Hey! Wait, what song you got here? King Vaughn? Hold on, we're gonna, we're gonna play this once we start uh, the gun, once we start the shooting. You boys been coming up to Pronghorn. I thought I'd come down here. You're all so tough. Bitch! God damn, okay. He just immediately started shooting. Let's go. 
Don't even ask when you come to catch, they catch a blast. Jam, get at that jam, I give them 50 and got an axe again. He was catching murders way back then, that's when the max was in. I don't drink that red or that green, it's back that act again. Fuck the then she told me that she hate me, now she back again. And you still alive, you better be lucky, ain't no track again. Hey, they ask so much, you dig them up and tell them die, die scum. I club all by myself, long as my strap is good. Niggas told me all the rappers pussy, ain't no rap again. I told them what type of car was in, I had to go get it rap again. Said when I get on, ain't no more stops, you fucking act. Bitch, you know we loud, we fucking thought he's on the map. Hey, pop out like a ghost, they like Bridge, they play back again. If a body moving, I swim back again, clap again. I be in the north, but it's like I'm so slim. Oh, black to my brothers, but 300 is my worry now. Don't be my fucking pilot. I be moving through this bitch, ain't worried about no opposite. Where's my throw knives at? Do I gotta throw a knife? No. I've been running up that bag. I've been chopping out that chop. Phone will scream and get back. You know I'm with that. Wait, there's a rare gun here. What kind of gun is this? Pump action. Give me the pump back. Give me the pump. Make a summer salt and put a money back. Ain't trying to stop no beef, nigga. We into it till you die. Real street, nigga. God, bitch. Rest in peace. Rest in peace. Expected Red Dead Redemption 2 and Dirk to mix so well. Cause John's devious like that dog. <laughs> John is just built different. What else do we got here? Double barreled shotgun. Hey. Hey. I know you're in here. Where is this motherfucker at? He's ah, nice. No good trash. Come on. Come here, you dumb bitch. Punch cow. Ain't nobody stopping us here. My wife ain't stopping me. Come on, pussy. Well, come on then. Oof. You gotta shout on Mal your ass. You know that woman of yours got the look of a woman ain't had a real ride in her life. She's gotta make do with some piss poor stinking farmhand. Hey, hey, tell her I'll let her in my sheets. As long as she bathes first in sheet dip, get the stink of you off of her. Farmhand. Shut up. Dumb bitch. I like that. Uh, I like that little. I like that little uh, Red Dead Redemption one reference right there. Yeah, that's what I was gonna say. He hit the Red Dead Redemption one pose, dog. That's how you know John's him. I'm back, boys. Hey, you're back. You did real well, Mr. Milton. This man can really fight. Save the whole place. Ah, that weren't nothing. Well, you, oh, you, <laughs> you saved my life. No need to say nothing, sir. Just doing my job. Now, I don't think they'll be back tonight, but how about, Abe, just in case you stay up? Yep. You see anything or hear anything, you fire that rifle three times. Three times. We'll all come running. Will do. 
Uh, well said. And thank you, Mr. Milton. Truly. Just glad to be of service, sir. Uh, I understand. You get some rest. Thank you, Mr. Geddes. That was a fun mission. What? I gotta what? do what I gotta do! What choice did I have? Just answer me that. What was I supposed to do? Keep the hat? Yeah, no, he's wearing Arthur's hat. But just do one thing or another. Not be two people at once. That's all I'm saying. Nice. All right, let's go do Abigail's mission right now. Wait, can I wear his hat? I want to wear it. I want to wear Arthur's hat instead of this uh, shitty ass fucking hat that I have on. This imposter hat. Give me Arthur's hat. How you getting on? Surviving. In your home. All right. I want to try to see if I can wear that. Copy. Only thing I know how to do is, well, you know, undertakers like me. Cattle, not so much. That ain't true. I ain't no rancher. Rustled horses, not raised them. Stole cattle, not birthed them. I was, I was reading the newspaper. I was reading about a old ranch, Beecher's Hope, down by Blackwater. Was you? Well. Jack read it to me, but I thought maybe we could raise some money. Bank could lend us the rest. We could be happy, John. We Bank could... loans? I got a goddamn price on my head, woman. I know. I know all about that. Every time we about to get somewhere, make something, you go and show the entire world that you ain't Jimmy Milton. Every place we've been, it's been the same. We start doing okay, and then boom. You act like the big man with the gun. I'm tired, John, and I guess I was dreaming a little. At least give me that. Just feels hopeless. You're, you're doing better. Milton. Milton. Milton, ma'am. Mr. Geddes needs you to head over to Strawberry in the wagon and collect some mail for him at the post office. Sure. I'll take the boy with me. He's getting soft. Lance a lot. Come on. Bro, is there any way I can shave off my beard? A parcel for me. Or at least give him a different beard, give him a different look. I think once we head back to Strawberry, I'm going to do that. I think so. One's in your name, and the other one's in mine. O only one should have come in by now. How much shopping you done? Oh, yes, a real keen purchaser of goods, me. Look at me. <laughs> okay, Lancelot. I'll make a man out of you yet. Not too much of a man, mine. He's only a boy. Just gonna show him how Let's to get down to business. To the feet. The hunts. Come on. Get. You take care Did of I ask for daughters? When I asked for sons. You're the saddest oh, bunch I ever met. When is Jack gonna learn how to shoot though? Bro, I'm pretty sure Abigail will go into cardiac arrest if she's fucking even so happens to find Jack with a gun. She'll legit go into cardiac arrest, stroke, aneurysm, name everything. It was foolish to forget mine, sir. Look. It feels so unnatural that the fact that Jack calls John, sir. Like, I know, like, they do that. I know he, like, does that to be respectful, but it still feels so weird. It doesn't even feel like that's, like, his dad. <laughs> yes, sir. Instead of saying dad or something. He only says paw, like, occasionally. Like, okay, paw. Yeah, dude. It just doesn't feel natural. You all right, son? Sure. Cheer up a little. Meanwhile, you'll have, you'll see like John call Jackson and then he'll just call him okay. sir. Uh, it just feels weird. I might let you drive us home. Can't wait. 
Can I shave my beard? Hi, I'm here. To name? M my name? Uh, Jim Milton. Jim Milton. Hmm. <laughs> nope. Nothing here. Uh, maybe try Marston. John Marston. It's a long story. Okay. John Marston. Marston. Oh, nope. God. Nothing here for that name either. Why did he do that? Hey, Abigail Roberts. Abigail Roberts. Abigail Roberts. Hmm. Yes, here we are. And also, I'm here to pick up the deliveries for Pronghorn Ranch. David Getty sent me. Pronghorn? Yes, er, uh, oh, er, uh, sign here. We have a bunch of stuff for you. And I will help you out. I'll take these. You get the rest of the stuff. That was definitely not a smart move here. by him. Oh, we're definitely getting ambushed, aren't we? Yep. Just keep driving. Oh boy. Do I have my piece on me or no? Okay. What? What's wrong? Don't look around. Oh, Pog, hey. those men, are they following us? Just, just stay calm. See that fallen tree? When we get there, stop the wagon, jump down, and hide. Oh, Pa. You need to do exactly as I say, boy. Here, now! Uh, come on, quick, now! Okay, son, you wait here. You don't move or say nothing until I speak to you. You hear? Yes, sir. Head down. Okay, gentlemen. Let's see what you come calling about. What do you boys want with us? Oh, we just want to have a friendly chat. Friendly you chat, us? huh? You sure look like them. I don't know what you're talking about. I'm just... Here with my son. Did you kill a fella out in Roanoke a few months back? No. Wasn't me. That was my brother. I'm real sorry, friend, but he was trying to rob. You're talking bullshit, mister. Kill him. Y'all suck. You're okay. What? Why? What? It's okay. It's okay. Come on. Keep them eyes closed. Let's go. Come on. Get up. If you hadn't listened, things could have gone real wrong for us. My boy. There, there. My boy. You're about to have a heart attack. Breathe, motherfucker. Breathe. Breathe. <gasps> in and out. Okay, here we are. That was an uh, eventful trip. Eventful. That's a that's a that's a good way to put it. Surely Abigail won't okay, hear about this, right? Never mind. What happened? Yeah. It's. I don't. We got shot at. Shot at? What happened? Well, we got followed and then. We... Followed by who? Probably someone who knew me. If we didn't get to them particulars, I'm sorry. My son. Our son. It was your dress that caused all the problem. It weren't even a dress. It was a gift for you. Nice. I don't know how John is going to break out of that cycle. I don't know. 
I'll go to buttfuck nowhere. Go to a different country, dog. Go to Tahiti. Mr. Jim? <laughs> it's time Mr. to go to Jim. Tahiti. Hey. Uh, there's a telegram messenger for you over there in, near the house. There is? Okay. Thanks, Abe. What do you think he wants? I have no idea. But I doubt someone wants to give me a big pile of money. Telegram. That's him. Who the fuck is that? Excuse me, mister. I'm Jim Milton. Heard you had a telegram for me? Yes. Here. Sign there. Thank you. Huh? Jim, stop. If you're the JM I know, stop. It's Sadie Adler. Sadie? Got something to discuss. Pay good. Meet me in saloon in Valentine. I'm there most days. Stop. Sadie Adler. Oh, Sadie man. Adler? How does she even know I was in here? What the hell? I thought most of them already went their all their own separate ways at this point. Darling John, a kind lady in the village helped me write this. She had men problems of her own, but that's a different story. Listen, I've begged you, but it don't seem to make much difference. I've tried everything I know to make you grow up. And you know I love you, but loving you means I can't watch you do this. Time after time, we've had to run because of your behavior and your decisions. We got a son. I got a son. And I love our son enough that I can't have him around while you're like this. I had so many dreams, John. I hoped you would change. We all saw what happened to them that didn't, but you... Part of you is hell-bent on ending up the same way. I love you too much to watch that no more. Abigail. Wait, so what? She went somewhere? What she get me new PJs? She got me new jammies, dude. Where's the wife, Milton? Uh, she's out. I saw her leaving with the boy and the bags. What's going on? You married, Mr. Dickens? No. That don't surprise me. What'd she do? Catch you with a showgirl? We hear about you shooting more fellas over by Strawberry? Just who are you, Jim Milton? I'm a family man. I can handle a gun, sure. Them men shot at me. Just interested, that's all. Ain't nothing interesting, unless you find gossip about a man's marriage worthy of your time. Guess not. There's work to be done, unless you're running off too. I ain't going nowhere. I'm here to work. Gotta save money, get her what she wants. What does she want? She wants a place of her own. Said she found a plot up at Beecher's Hope. You? A rancher? You'll starve. Probably. <laughs> Keep yourself busy. Take your mind off it. Okay. You got rid of all your emotes? I don't... Did I? I'm pretty sure most of my emotes should still be there. I don't think I've touched any of my emotes at all. I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure I should have all my emotes there. Alright, time to fix the parents. I might have to figure that out later. That's weird though. I thought for sure like most of my emotes would already be good. These ju these nuts jokes for life? Please, d please no. I think I'd rather... I think I'd rather soak my nuts in boiling hot water and have to hear another these nuts joke again.
So when am I going to be able to shave my beard? I want to shave the beard. Oh my god! That's an Overwatch reference! Mercy! Oh my god! That's so cool! But that's her fool. Hey, you know, I was wrong about you. Turned into a fine worker, Jim Milton. Oh, thank you. Means a lot. <laughs> hey, you think I could speak with Mr. Geddes? See if maybe he's open to offering me some guidance? No, I'm sure he'd be happy to hear you speak, at least. Thank you, Mr. Dickens. Listen, I get, I get very excited about references. Look, it's a dog! Here, boy. Woof! Hey, son. How's that bull? Fine, Mr. Milton. Your father in? Can I have a word? Sure. I'll just get him. Pow! Hey, I'm right, right here. <sighs> What's the problem, Milton? I'm sorry for the disturbance, sir. Oh, no problem. My wife, she just began her morning discourse on the subject of my faults. An experience I think every man can relate to. In some ways, my wife... My wife also has issues with some of the decisions I've made. Real issues. Hmm? Do you believe a man can change, sir? Where is this heading? No. I guess I don't know. <clears throat> I've tried to be a good hand. I've worked hard to secure your property. And for that, we are grateful. And you've paid me well besides. The thing is, I suppose, I need to get a place of my own so I can prove to my wife that I've changed. I understand. But I ain't got much money. I ain't asking to borrow none. But maybe you could go to the bank and put in a good word so they could give me a loan. A loan, huh? So I can buy that place, Beecher's Hope? Yes, I know it. Yes, of course, sure. It'd be, it'd be my pleasure. Nice. Take my advice, Milton. Take your money and go buy passage on a boat. Go to Brazil and forget all about Brazil it. reference! Oh my Joking. god! Just make sure you deal with Ansel Atherton at the bank. That's a He's freaking a Brazil customer. reference! He is my name. Tell him to ask me direct himself. You'll get what you need. Thank you, sir. Yeah, I was young and dumb once, too. <laughs> You'll get her back. Not me barking for free. Woof. I love Brazil. <laughs> Is that a football reference? Oh my god, a football reference! Ah! It's a football reference! Footy! I love footy! Oh boy. Jim Milton. Where did he get that fucking outfit from? Has he had it this entire time? Oh nice, we can actually fucking ride now. Let's ride. <laughs> 